Yeah, um, I'm pretty mad because usually I like to get these pack openings out pretty early, but um, I just woke up and my alarm went off three hours after I wanted it to. It was 11 p.m. I needed to wake up at 1 a.m. It's a bit tough in Australia, time zone wise. But yeah, I set my alarm to have a two hour nap. I woke up at 4 a.m. It's a bit of a rip. But anyway, in positive news, we do have these finals packs, which looks so fire. Because first of all, I love the pack art. Second of all, the players in it are insane. We've got a pink diamond Moses Malone, then a diamond LeBron James, a diamond Magic Johnson, an amethyst Clay Thompson, who's always going to be crazy, Pau Gasol, Bobby Jones, Byron Scott, Bruce Bowen, Chris Bosh, Tom Heinsohn, Steve Kerr, Kendrick Perkins as the players. And the thing is, these packs actually guarantee the players because we have deluxe ones. So then there's also a 10 pack box and also if we go over to the set when you complete every single one you get a pink diamond chauncey billups also 2k hit me with a little pack you guys know what that means i've got a giveaway for you guys so first of all let's see if we can get this video to 2500 likes i'd appreciate that a lot and all you have to do to enter the giveaway let's see who this card is going to be later but yes the card i'm able to give away to one of you guys is none other than the diamond lebron james so be sure to first of all like the video comment down below your psn your gamer tag your nintendo switch Steam anything and then also I'd really appreciate it if you're able to go over to my Facebook and hit like dash follow as at the time of you guys watching this video I should be live streaming on there and I've got big plans ahead and basically Facebook want to see what a test stream would be like for my fan base and see how many viewers and stuff I can get on a live stream so let's see how many we can get in on that live stream that should be happening at the time of you guys watching this video but yeah that's pretty much it then you're in the running to be able to get this diamond LeBron but anyway as of us right now it's time to open up these packs I'm a little bit nervous because a 10 pack box of deluxe packs sounds like a lot of fun it sounds good because it's guaranteed players but in the past i really haven't been lucky with these types of packs because really we just get sapphires like this i mean chris bosh is pretty nice to start with and another thing that i don't like about deluxe packs is they take way like they're so quick to open i feel like steve kerr is also going to be a really good card just for the fact that like He's got a really high three ball, hopefully, and he's only an emerald. But we do get a ruby this time. Haven't seen an amethyst or anything. It's going to be Bruce Bowen, a really good defender. Can also shoot the three. Probably a good budget card and no wiggle this time. Another ruby. Who's it? Byron Scott. You know what we want to see. We just want to see that diamond or pink diamond. And if I'm able to get one in this box, I'll be happy. As we get Bobby Jones, I always have a memory from 2K19 with that card that it went for like 400K or something crazy like that. There's the wiggle that we want to see. Please be pink diamond. It is a diamond. That's very, very good because this could be LeBron James. I know it's LeBron from the Heat. So we want to see Eastern Conference. Eastern, 93. Six. It is LBJ. Let's go, baby. I wanted this card, and we just pulled him out of our first box. The most expensive one, more than likely, I think. Let's go. Let's go. That makes these packs so good already with LeBron in the first pack. And that's what I'm going to be doing in my uh, live stream later is I'm going to be showing off these players and like playing games with them and stuff. So be on the lookout for that on my Facebook, as I said. But anyway, next pack up, not too great with a Sapphire, but this box has been very much worth it because we got LeBron, the best player out of them all. If we can see one more wiggle in this box, I would go crazy. Byron Scott, final pack of this one the tenor and no wiggle but we do get a sapphire okay that's fine it's a new player too so just from one box we got seven of the players so actually pretty good especially because i think we got the best one being lebron we can't stop after one box though let's go into the next and straight away we're getting an emerald that's the thing that i don't like about these packs is the fact that in that last box if we didn't get lebron i'd be very disappointed but um, I guess we've got to be in it to win it. Imagine if I was able to pull the whole set. I would go pretty crazy, but doesn't really look like it right now. I think we... I, I, I think that's our full, first time pulling Kendrick Perkins. I'm not 100% sure. But anyway, hopefully we can see one more wiggle. That's the main thing. Is it called a wiggle? Is it called a shake? I'm really not sure, but they call me... Um, Okay, th that's fine. I feel like so many of the cards that are below Ruby in this set are actually going to be fire. There's another wiggle. Pink Diamond. It's only an Amethyst. That's fine. We get Patty Mills too. From my hometown, fun fact, that's where he's from. But anyway, we're going to get Western Conference, 91 overall. It is going to be a finals player, number 16, center. That means it's going to be none other than Pau Gasol, which is definitely not a bad card. I mean, the pack lock's actually looking pretty good for this time, so I guess I'm not complaining at all. But one more wiggle. No, not in this one. That's fine. It's cool. Because maybe number eight is going to be great. Only a ruby there. Okay. Hopefully you guys can see why I'm not a huge fan of the deluxe packs. Just for the fact of how quickly it goes. But I mean, the pack luck hasn't been too bad for us recently. 
and that's a bad ending, but it's all right. I feel like this has gone so quickly, but let's go into another box. One thing that I really don't do in my pack openings that I should do quite a bit more often is check out the pack odds. I know you can look at it, but I never do. I just jump into it and hope for the best, which isn't the greatest. But yeah, if you guys are wondering where my past pack openings have been, fun fact, I did actually record them. They just went so badly. And also I recorded them really late because I've been hanging out with a particular stuff someone maybe that person was from the opposite gender will you'll have to find out but yeah so apologies about the pack openings i did record them and i posted one of them on my facebook actually just because my pack luck really wasn't good at all so if you want to check it out oh what there's a shake as well i did not see that i saw the ruby pink diamond it's only an amethyst is it going to be a player from the finals i'm pretty sure it is because we got luca in the first one but there is actually two amethysts out of this so 91 overall western conference it's gonna be power gasol once again but we've got a wiggle in every single 10 pack box so far the first one being by far the best with lebron james maybe we can get one more but yeah my pack luck was so bad that i didn't really want to post it hopefully you guys understand ruby there okay and as i said i also recorded it really really late so it wouldn't have been the best video to post at like 2 p.m my time which is like literally like 2 a.m your time if you're from america but okay cool nice one more wiggle one more wiggle that ain't it that is a ruby and a sapphire all right i'm gonna open up another box let's do it so i'm gonna open up these packs until we don't get a diamond or higher so i know that's a bit tough on 2k but if you want to get me good pack lock then hit me with a diamond and i'll continue to open up boxes so first pack up of this new rule that we've had sapphire not the grace of stars one thing i can say about this year and i say it in pretty much every single pack opening that i do is the card art is so fire like i reckon it's one of my favorite every 2k just for the fact that like just wait for this have a look at that the background and everything it is a plus there's a shake is it going to be a diamond or higher it is a diamond so that means we've got to do another box but I'm not complaining at all about that. I want it to be LeBron so then I can sell him for more MT. Eastern Conference 93, number six. It is LeBron James once again. That is a fire pull because this man has to go for over 100K. So LeBron, I'm just going to sell you and then we'll be good to go. That's the card I'm giving away, as I said. So be sure to do those things before and check out my stream if you want to see gameplay on that man straight away. Also, it will be linked down below in the description. So don't be on the, don't, don't worry about that. We get a Ruby here. Byron Scott I feel like we haven't really seen Byron Scott that often now that I think about it but very happy we got that shake we get Bobby Jones in the next this is what I'm talking about is if you don't get a diamond or an amethyst these packs go by so quickly Byron Scott again number nine 90 percent of the way through there's a wiggle another diamond let's go and bron Ra bronze range extender trying to think of who the other diamond is Eastern Conference 93 overall number six again LeBron James like this card has to go for a lot of MT and we have pulled in three times, two times in this box. Can we make it back to back for the diamonds right now in pack number 10? I would go pretty crazy. Not in this time, but that was, that was fire. So I stick to my word. We're going to do another box. And yes, we got two in that last one, but I'm still going to stick with it that I need a diamond or higher to be able to continue opening up these packs. So 2k, if you want to give me that same pack lock that we had in the last box, then I'm just going to continue and uh, no wiggle in this one. All right, it's an emerald. I feel like we've seen so many Kendrick Perkins, but we've also seen so many LeBrons. I can't complain. Uh, maybe this is going to get a bit better because right now I don't think we've seen anything above a Sapphire in this box. The fight. Okay, this is not looking great. I feel like it always happens. You go from a really good box to then a really bad box. It might just be me that's noticed that, but for me, that's definitely the case. We need to come clutch with a diamond or higher though. Still, just these sapphires. Pack number eight. That, um, yeah, all right. Is it time on number nine? Okay, it's definitely not. That's tough. And now for number 10. Can we come clutch? No, we can't. No wiggle in that one. That box was terrible. Now we're just going to head into a couple of singles and try them out. So the finals deluxe packs, the 15k packs. Yes, they're expensive, but, um... It's not great if you're getting Ruby like that. Next. I'm actually so mad how late I woke up, but maybe this video could do better. I don't know if I bring it out later. We'll have to see. I'm going to open up these packs until I get below a Ruby. So um, is this going to be the final one? Yes, it is. All right. But now I just want to try out one of the non-deluxe ones just to see what we're able to get in this one. So is, are we going to get a play up from the set? Great question. Let's have a look. No wiggle and... 
It might be a player from the set. Yeah, it is. Let's keep him going. Next. I kind of spent way too much VC in this pack opening. I apologize to my credit card, but that's going to be the final pack. Yes, it is a player from the set too. So one thing that I do want to see is, did we get challenges as well for these? Let's go down. Um, Yes, we did. 38 of them. Wow. Make 40 dunks. That one's easy with LeBron. Yep. 150 points with Moses. That's easy as well. And then 35 threes for 2000 XP. That's crazy. But now it's time for us to open up this pack that 2K was able to give us. And this is the card that I'm able to give away to one of you guys. So it's pretty exciting because once we see this, we see the diamond glow. That's what I'm excited for because this man is going to be what? Our first fourth time? First time? Fourth time getting him, I think, in this pack opening because it's LeBron James once again. But at least I'm able to give it away to one of you guys. Remember, leave your gamer tag, PSN, Steam, whatever, down below. Like the video and also you don't have to, but I'd appreciate it heaps if you check out my Facebook when I'm streaming. So yeah, that that's the card that you could win. Because if we look at the players that we're able to get from this pack opening, it doesn't look like this pack opening went great. But then you realize we pulled what? Like kind of four LeBron Jameses? And he's by far the most expensive of them all. Magic does actually go for quite a bit. Clay surprisingly goes for a bit of MT as well. And then Moses Malone is like one of the cheaper ones out out of them all. So I think LeBron was definitely the best pull out of all of them. But yeah, also this week is the final week to be able to get Ralph Sampson. And the way we're able to get it is by using a lineup in limited that every single player must have won an NBA championship, which is so many players. So yeah, that doesn't seem bad at all. And I know this pack opening might have not been the flashiest, but I got to say, I'm pretty happy with how it went because what? We got four LeBron James and that'll easily allow us to be able to get this Chauncey Billups to then be able to get a lot of XP to then finally be able to get Steph. Yes, I am planning on getting him. I just haven't really been grinding like crazy, but I will be soon. Don't worry. But anyway, that's pretty much the end of the video. As I said, 2,500 likes I think I asked for. Let's see if we can hit it. Sorry that this video was late, but again, I'm going to be live streaming on Facebook and I'd really appreciate if you guys can come over and then you can check out these players actually in action. So that's pretty much all I got to say. Thank you for watching. Make sure to follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And that's pretty much all I got to say. Thank you for watching and I'll catch you in my next video. Bye.